Hi everyone, this is Halal Ahmed and you are watching Soft Coding. Welcome to another video of Flutter app development. Guys, in this video, I will show you how you can set up Flutter in uh, your Android Studio. So open up your Android Studio and make sure you have the latest version of Android Studio. So you will get some interface like this, okay? And uh, when the Android Studio is open, uh, click on plugins and from here, uh, go to marketplace and here we will search for flutter okay so search for flutter and as you can see here uh, we have the uh, flutter plugin here and we just need to click on install and the flutter plugin says that uh, flutter plugin requires dart plugin to be installed so it will automatically insert the dart plugin so click on install and uh, it will take some time Okay, our Flutter and Dart plugin is installed and we need to restart our IDE. So click on restart IDE and click on restart. Okay, as you can see, uh, we have restarted our Android Studio and uh, we will click on this why we are not getting create a new flutter project okay so the flutter is disabled so we will enable it okay and i will just simply restart it again Okay, as you can see here, uh, we have uh, option here, new Flutter project. So to create a new Flutter project, just click on it. And from here, uh, select your SDK path and it is automatically selected. Okay, so if it, uh, if it, uh, it is not selected automatically, so you can uh, paste your SD, uh, Flutter SDK path here and we will click on next and from here we will change the project name so i will just uh, simply call it uh, demo flutter project okay and this is the project location and this is the project description if you want to change it so you can change it from here and from here you can select the android language so uh, by default uh, it is kotlin and for ios it is swift okay and uh, if you change if you want to change it to java or objective c so you can change it and click on finish so it will create our new flutter project okay guys as you can see here our new flutter project is created and it is ready to use so if we go to main or dart and this is the code which is generated by default 
so that's how that's it for this video and in next video i will show you how you can create or how you can set up uh, your flutter in the vs code okay so please make sure you are subscribed to my channel and the notification option is on so you won't miss the upcoming videos